Hey guys, quick update to my previous video where I showed you a, a technique where you can scroll through a long uh, sample. So here I've got just some random recordings from pretty much from my phone while I was just in the kitchen. So I've got all these interesting different sounds. So lots of interesting stuff going on, you know, just kind of weird, noisy stuff. And this is the kind of stuff that I might add, you know, to a groove or something just to give it a little more texture or what have you. But I might just want like little short bits um, in here, like maybe something like this size or, or whatever, right? So the easy approach that I can take is I can place, let's say, this length right here. And if I wanted, let's say, the sample to be like right here, then what I would do is I would duplicate this, turn this off, and now I can um, pull this back here through the sample, and then I'd be able to scroll through and find different sounds, right? And as you can see over here, as I scroll, it's scrolling through this long kind of raw recording, right? So that was cool and all, um, but when I posted it in a certain forum, some uh, people gave me some flack for not knowing the real technique. So let me show you the real technique, the easier technique. So. If we've got our sample here and we've got our length that we want, what we can actually do is if you're on a Mac, you hold down the Alt key and then as you drag, it will scroll through without lengthening the clip. So as long as you hold down alt, the Alt key, then you can kind of just find your sample that way. It just saves you a little bit of time if you use the Alt key. I think uh, on a PC you would use the Control key. Um, it's one of those keys, either Control or Command. Uh, I don't think it's Alt on a PC. And as long as you hold that down, then you can kind of scroll through your clip. All right? So I hope that helps you guys.